We all here, y'all. I'm here by the fire pit. Just chilling out on a beautiful April 2nd day. The sun's in my face. I'm loving this weather. I have my jacket on. My husband's cutting up some wood. He's splitting some wood, actually, that we have there that's already seasoned. And I'm all here just sitting by, enjoying the warmth of this fire and the sunny day. The dog is out playing with the chicken, just getting along. While wow. we're here over here doing our thing, we didn't plan on this today, but it's going down, it's happening. The sun's in my eyes. There's a few things with this going on back here today that I would think about in a situation where we would have to resort to certain things or there's a shift and we have to figure out what we're going to do this tool right here is a good tool to have it's manual you don't have to worry about electricity or any power propelling it for it to work so this is one of the things that we have to think about in situations and it gives you something to do to keep you busy and distracted is that oak or pine oh well, that need to go over in the woodshed yep Pine can stay here, but the oak need to go in the woodshed. Yep. Cause that's what we're gonna be cooking on if it comes to that. All this dog wanna be out here doing is playing. Work is going on. Progression is taking place, and she just wanna be out here playing. <laughs> Like she's bad. Like I'm gonna get to you. I'm gonna get to you. Silly girl. Silly girl. <laughs> That's all she wanna do. Play. You have to have energy for this dog. Trust me. All the time. Put his glove down. Drop it. Drop it. All right, back to work. Dora, let him work, please. We need to get the wood splitted. Split. Split it. Split. What's the word? What's the word? Split it? Split. Split. <laughs> Where I come from, we say split. <laughs> split it. What is split it? She. Split. So we need to get the wood split. English has definitely become difficult. Back to work. I know you didn't come out here to split wood, but you need your boots. You're not even wearing your boots, sir. And I'm just sitting here chilling with my feet up, with my foot up near the fire pit. Getting some nice warmth. That's some good fire starter, right? That's a bark of the wood. Can you pick it up? Thank you, baby. Oh yeah, that's just a bark. And that's some good seasoned wood too. How that wood. Yeah. It's a technique in splitting wood. You don't have to use all that energy. You have to figure out the uh, the craft of splitting wood manually. You don't necessarily need a wood splitter. You just have to know how to use that tool. We call it an axe. What do they call it here? I don't know. There's another name they call it. That yeah, that. we call that an axe. We we call it an axe where it come from. I can't even talk. 
maybe I should stop sipping at this point, but. We we're supposed to go look for um, the spot where we're gonna put those other two IBC tanks. I thought that's what we should. Yeah, but up. you wanted to go split wood and we didn't set out to do that today, but that's fine because we need some wood split either way. We gotta get these wood split and packed up in our, those buckets don't belong there. That's our woodshed. They don't, all those things that we have stored up there don't belong there. We just stored it up for the winter but now that it's spring, we are going to take all these season wood and we're going to split those. Well, we. I'm here for moral support. And he's going to split all this wood and we're going to pack them. Well, I have to help him pack it in because that's what I do. I don't split the wood, but I help pack it in the woodshed. So we fill all these. We burn a lot of wood because we spend a lot of time out here near the fire pit. We grill on this. We have a grill. And a smoker in there in that woodshed right there but um we we use a lot of wood on here and we have a grill that we put over it and we cook our meat or vegetables on there and we cook outdoors a lot when it's warmer out so we just out here splitting some wood getting things in order packing it away in the woodshed to get ready for some more free wood because we always get free wood because we seek out free wood it's there it's available and we find a way to get it here for free you you look like you're in the mold now yeah. i think you should switch to your boots huh? i think you should switch to your boots in case that fall on your toes because i don't want to hear it <laughs> Safety first. I don't want him to wait till that any of that wood falls on his toe, on his toes, and then complain, oh, I busted my toes. Because we didn't come out here to split any wood. He wanted to put up the gazebo today. I don't know if you can see it back there. It's April 2nd, and he got excited because it's nice and sunny out, but it's still cold. And he partially put up the gazebo on the deck. And then we were supposed to... Here he is with his boots. <laughs> he just loves staying active. Here he is with his boots. He's going to switch into his boots. Steel toe so he can be safe. Tora, let him work, please. She is so spoiled. Girl. Give her a piece of wood, let her go chew on it. What? What? Look at her. She thinks she's cute. Go. Let me tie my shoe. <laughs> she's like, you're not tying them shoes today. No, let me tie my shoe. <laughs> She wants you to get up and run after her. That's what she wants. Let me tie my shoe. <laughs> Let me tie my <clears throat> Don't look at me. You're the one spoiling her. <laughs> Did you just beat me, dog? <laughs> Dora, please, let me tie my shoe. Come here, girl. Dory, come. Go see mom. Come. Come over here. Look. Come. You want to play? Go get the ball. Where's your ball? Go get your ball. Get your ball. Go get the ball. What you digging for? Dora, stop digging. Go get your ball. I did not say to dig. Dora, stop. <laughs> So yeah, back to splitting wood on this beautiful spring evening. Is it evening or afternoon? Oh, it's 4.31 right now. I guess this is what it's going to be like for the rest of the evening. 
Don't do too much though. Because you didn't set out to do that today. Yeah. But I know when you get started, it's go time. That's like therapy for you, right? Yep. <laughs> You always say that you lost. Once you start, that's it. I gotta watch you. <laughs> I really do. He makes it look so easy. I have tried to use that axe before and split wood, but listen, there's a way you're supposed to swing. Look, he's doing it with one hand. One hand. I don't think I can ever one hand that thing. It's a technique, he said, so. I'll listen to him. He makes it look very easy. All right, so that's about it. We're just going to be out here continuing to split that wood and maybe pack it in at some point. But I'm not in the mood for packing that wood in the woodshed today. So once it gets split, I can always do that when he's not home. When he's out at work, I can do that on a really nice spring day when I want to come outdoors and do something. So it's not time to plant in my garden yet. So I'm just gonna probably pack some of that wood in the woodshed. What? Hope you enjoyed this video. We're just out here hanging out and I just figured I roll the camera and get going, show you what we do on a regular. Just come out here and do our thing. But the difference is I'm just rolling the camera on what we're doing. As always, thank you for watching and I'll see you again next time right here on Fifi's Journey.